So Namali here, uh, pre-diabetes or diabetes type two runs in her family and she never strength trained at all, only did some cardio aerobic at home, right? Yeah, yeah. Treadmill. We have a treadmill at home, so I would, I would use that. Uh, we, I would take walks around our neighborhood a little bit, but I actually never did strength training. So she joined here about eight months ago and strength trained twice a week and was consistent, um, which is the normal um, requirement for adults is to strength train just twice a week. And only 24% of adults actually strength train twice a week. And we basically know that strength training is probably the best antidote or medicine or prevention about uh, to treat and reverse type 2 diabetes and prediabetes, besides a healthy diet, of course, um, and weight loss. Uh, so basically, her A1C, which is the gold standard uh, test for um, diabetes or blood sugar levels, um, normal is below a 5.7. 5.7 to 6.4 A1C is pre-diabetes and above 6.5% higher is diabetes type mm -hmm. 2. And so she was always like a 5.7 yes. pre-diabetes. 5.7, sometimes 5.8. So yeah. it's hovering. Hovering. And then eight months later, what happened? Came down 5.2. 5.2. So totally normal. Amazing. And that's some twice a week strength yep. training. Yeah. Um, and I just want to read off. Uh, so... What strength training does to lower your blood sugar levels and, and you know reverse type two or help prevent type two and prediabetes, uh, the muscle acts like a sponge for sugar. So basically, after strength training, your muscles soak up glucose from the blood to refuel, which lowers blood sugar levels naturally. Um, it improves insulin sensitivity, so your muscles become better at using insulin. So your body doesn't need to produce as much to manage blood sugar. Um, builds more muscle equals more sugar storage. So the more muscle you have, the more places your body has to store and use glucose. And then of course, strength training reduces harmful belly fat. We all want that. Strength training cuts visceral fat, which is linked to insulin resistance and inflammation. Visceral fat is the fat um, around your organs in your stomach. It boosts energy burning cells. It improves how your mitochondria work so your body becomes more efficient at burning sugar uh, for fuel. And then uh, can actually reverse prediabetes and type 2 diabetes. And this is, I'm reading from ChatGPT. ChatGPT is the um, artificial intelligence app. It's basically Google on steroids. So it's taking all the information from across the internet. So if ChatGPT, it's not me telling you this, it's ChatGPT. So look it up for yourself. So it actually could reverse prediabetes and type 2. When done regularly, strength training helps lower blood sugar and A1C over time. Yeah, it's been great. Thank you so much Anytime. for doing this.